Hey guys, today's the day we've all been waiting for. So I've been dropping hints on my channel for a while now about a secret project I've been working on and I can finally share it with you guys. And trust me when I say, it's going to be amazing. Oh, we're starting, gotta go, come on. Welcome to the challenge. I've been dreaming of taking home this title for weeks now. I'm confident that I can win today's challenge. I mean, walking into the kitchen today, all I could think about was strawberries are like yellow and white and red. If you mix yellow and red together, do you get orange? Mmm. Courtney, I'm so glad you're pretty. <laughs> Thanks. I can't wait to see what the challenge is for today. The anticipation is almost too much to handle. Oh my gosh, it's so oh, thank you so much. It's the challenge. Okay. <laughs> Welcome, cooks. That's us. It's time for our first challenge. Today's challenge is all about heart. Aww. You'll each have one minute to complete your dishes. For today's challenge, you'll be creating dishes inspired by you and what you love. Mm -hmm. That's right. Today, you'll each be showing us the kind of cook you are by creating something that reflects what you're passionate about. Mm. You'll find everything you need in your lunchbox. Awesome. Should we open it? Let's do it. Three, two, one. <gasps> Licorice! Oh my goodness, best day ever! Okay, cooking is super simple if you're amazing at it, and like, it's exhausting being this amazing all the time that someone's gotta do it. Might as well be. You ready, girl? Let's, Let's do, do this! <laughs> this week's challenge requires more than just skill and precision from the competitors. It requires heart. The challenge sounds easy, but licorice is extremely difficult to construct with. You know, Picking a dish that I love wasn't the hard part. It was finding something that's gonna go well with licorice. So I decided to make a gingerbread house. Why? Because I love Christmas, and I know a lot of other people love Christmas too. So I believe this is gonna be a crowd pleaser. Oh, that's such a great idea. I mean, I'm making a white chocolate molten lava cake with berry licorice coolie. It's my absolute favorite dessert, and I love it so much. And I think choosing to plate this piece will really show off my creativity and, and my heart. So. With my skills, I'm sure I'll win. <laughs> it just needs... 30 seconds left. Okay, okay, so I need literally all licorice. Uh, Courtney? Uh-huh? Are you at all concerned that your dessert is not gonna stand the weight of that licorice? No. I think more just adds more love, you know? Okay. Time's up. Courtney, please present your dish. Are you ready for the greatest dish of all time? I mean, this is the most magnificent, spectacular, mind-boggling, no! It completely collapsed under the weight of the licorice. I can't believe this. I mean, my dish was so good. I loved it. After comparing the two dishes, the cook that came out on top was Landon. This is my command. Love each other as I have loved you, John 15, 12. I just really loved it so much. I mean, there was color, there was depth. Join us next week for more of the challenge. Who will take home the title and who will be cut from the competition? And yours is just like a, mine is beautiful. <laughs>